Hi and welcome to the channel. This is going to be a very quick video to show the new Ghost Zepto receiver from Immersion RC. This is the smaller of the two receivers currently available. The Atto receiver, which is the larger one here. This is the one that you get as part of the starter kit. The starter kit is what I purchased a few weeks ago and I've been using it since then. I'm going to be putting out a video shortly sharing my opinion of the Ghost system at its current state, but this is just a quick video around the smaller receiver. As mentioned, you get three of the Atto receivers with the starter kit. One of mine had an issue, this one, and now it won't actually power on. So I contacted support. Support have been waiting on stock of the receivers in order to supply me a replacement. I got contacted the other day and they don't have stock of the Atto yet, but they did have stock of the Zepto and asked if I wanted that instead. And they also included the 20 by 20 proton pack alongside it as well, which I thought was nice. So the proton pack has all the solder points you'll need for both the receiver and video transmitter. This is, it's got direct solder points for the Tramp Nano, as well as the Ghost receivers, both the larger area for the Atto receiver and if you snap the bit off the end it will fit the Zepto receiver perfectly. Onto the Zepto receiver. So it comes with the cable and heat shrink the same as the Atto. That's the Zepto. It is tiny as you can tell. So it's 10mm by 10mm and 2.5mm thick. And that's it sat on a US quarter or a UK 10 pence piece. And that's the size difference between the Atto and the Zepto. You also get the new Micro QT antenna. The head and the active elements are exactly the same size, but there is a shorter coax and a different connector. The Micro QT and Zepto weigh 1.3 grams together. I'll be getting this into a quad soon. I'm just waiting on some parts to be delivered in order to build my next 5 inch and this will probably make it into that one. So lastly, just a quick thanks to Dave at Immersion RC Support for sorting this out for me and getting me the new receiver as soon as possible. And thanks for watching. Cheers.